Hi everyone, what's up everyone? Just uh, doing a live, uh, just being in the now, sharing some uh, insight coming on the fly as I walk. We are here in Greece, uh, it's like today around 40 degrees Celsius. It's getting hotter and hotter. It's really a hot summer, especially with all this happening around. We are seeing it all over the places with all the floods and everything, which of course is not natural. It's all made, man-made, as we all know, and more and more, 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 more people can see this now. I hope so. So the temperatures are rising, and how are you doing with the temperatures? Are you good? Are you friends with the, the hot temperatures, or I don't know if it rains around you? around your place. Are you friends with the weather? It's the first step in the day. I always try my best to become friends with the weather because otherwise it's a wrong way to start the day. <laughs> so uh, however this looks, snow uh, called uh, warm, super warm, uh, I always find a reason to, uh, to settle with the energies and uh, get myself uh, on the right track of things. Because uh, there is always, the mind will always find reasons to complain, you see, so, so it's better to start the day and to focus on, on, the, on the good things, even if it's too hot or it's too warm or it's too cold. <laughs> We got some sound. We got some sound effects around, so I I let you go be a little bit in the in the city mood. The Dutch friend passing by. So yeah, this is the thing. This is the what I'm speaking about. Is always to uh, to wherever we are to uh, to intend to uh, to stay in the frequency of feeling good because uh, this is also attracting everything around us. To, um, by all costs, to not allow anything around us take us away from our uh, our energy, from our center, because the energies are very strong, and uh, and the more the energies get stronger, the more we need to be mastering this this power within to stay peaceful, no matter what happens around, and and if you can start doing this. Then it, it all, all it's magical around. No matter what happens, it's all super soft. And it, because we all create our own realities by the way you vibrate, the way you feel any given moment. So if we just set the intention for the day to uh, to stay on this peaceful frequency and and work on it, it takes some 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 active work to do this at home or, or you know first thing in the morning wake up in the morning and do like 15 or 20 minutes going within and finding the peace within and then again and then starting the day it really helps and if you do daily practice like this then then everything is much much more is much more easier in the day so so the point is to remain in this in this peaceful mood no matter where you are 
no matter uh, the city or uh, if you want to be in a monk in a, in, in, a, in a desert, I understand, okay, but the point is also to be everywhere like this. And this is the, the real, the real deal. The real deal is to be in the city, to be in the noise and to stay peaceful no matter what happens around, no matter what the people say, no matter what the people express and, and to stay on that. Oh, look what I found. I found a little doll. Hello, how are you? <laughs> so this little doll from Iran is saying hello to you, probably a child lost it. So this is like my little, uh, my little gift for today. I'm taking you home. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Bye. So, uh, so this is it. You know, it's 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 really uh, crucial in this time to to be this this uh, vortex of positive for peacefulness wherever we are and and it, this is not difficult to do it's very simple actually it's just yes Jimena I'm in Greece yes yes I'm in the city of Ioannina in Greece yes so so th this is the point that I'm that I'm again putting the accent on these are times these times are super 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 strong energy is taking place and and we need to be aware of this this is the big elephant hiding hiding in in in, in plain sight and and if we manage if we can see this and can be aware of the energies taking place what is the energies taking place what is what are the energies affecting us the energies affecting us is simply energy coming from the sun from the central galactic sun that is more and more and more and more and more and more and more becoming stronger and stronger. And it and you need to be the active portals of these energies to absorb these energies and and to ground them to the earth. And so if I'm in the city, I take a tree, hug a tree. Maybe somebody will think you're stupid, but it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter what people think around you, you know. But if you do this, just doing like this, if you just sit there and just take the time and hug a tree in the city, it's already doing its work. The tree is helping. It's actively assisting for this to take place. So hugging trees is really powerful for grounding the energies, for staying in the peaceful mode. And this is the whole name of the game. Can you stay peaceful? Do you have good breaks? What kind of breaks do you have? Are your brakes strong enough to not react to any of this, what's taking place out there? And then, whatever we are, whatever situation, if you are, even if you are in a flood situation or whatever happens, this is almost the final test. We are at the end of this three-dimensional existence. This is the end of the end of the end happening for this all three the world energies and if there is one thing that we must in this now do is to remain peaceful at all costs and and um, don't have to speak don't have to uh, um, impose upon anyone what we think and what we believe our belief system everybody is free to have their own belief system Everybody is free to have their own truth and from there build up, restore this planet because that's where we go next. The restoration of this planet is going to be a huge undertaking happening in many, 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 many areas. And you and me and everybody will be on this train doing this work. There is so much to do, have so much work to do in the, next, in the coming years that it is actually this is the gift coming this is the new life we're going to be having and to get there in the golden age the new earth reality well we have like a few years of transition and transition taking place in many many different aspects of life and our heart knows what is 
our best direction. For me, it was always about communities. So communities, creating communities, because I know that getting back our, our sovereignty to be sustainable and autonomous, having our own free energy, having our own, our own uh, mobility, having our, our, our own uh, foods and, and water and everything in communities, this is the deal, real deal. This is what is going to take place and this is how we take back our sovereignty and this is what is happening now with governments trying to persuade us that they are sovereign over, over us. This is not true, <laughs> okay? Governments, as we speak, are being dissolved. Governments, they have no power to the people. People, people, we are sovereign, each one of us. I am sovereign. As I say this, I am sovereign. I am sovereign. I am sovereign. When I say these words, there is no country or government can, control, can have control over me. No country can have control. No country can, can force me to do anything with my body. Okay? So when they are doing this, they are doing this. It's, 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 a, it's an effort to try to convince people to take away the sovereignty. And those who accept it, it's just because they don't know. They don't know that they have this power to do whatever they wish to do in their lives because they think, oh, maybe, you know, if I do this and this, I'm not, I'm not going to be able to, uh, to help my family, to sustain my family, and how I'm going to make money. It's a normal fear, okay, but, but that's how they use it. And, and this is the, the shift taking place. And this is the moment right now, more than ever, those of us who are listening to this message, to stay in the peaceful stage, to stay in the peaceful, to hold the space for everybody else, because everybody's coming up, on rising on the energy, everybody's rising the vibration, so for our sisters and brothers, we must hold this space for them, so they can also understand that, it is, that is what is happening, that is why people are rising up, and, and doing all these protest, protest around, protests around the planet, it's happening. So we hold the space for them and uh, we ask for always to remain peaceful at all times, wherever this happens. This is how we take our power back. Our power back doesn't come with resistance to something, okay? We don't oppose something. We don't oppose anything because everything, anything, every, every time that we try, we try to oppose something, we make it stronger. The change is happening by being the love and being the peace in the now, by radiating this out. This is how the change is happening. So if you do a protest, we don't go against anything. We are for love. We are the love, we are the light. This is how things change. This is how we create a powerful shift in everything that happens. And yeah, protest for me, when I go into a protest, it's just a celebration. It's just people gathering together because our people are waking up and for me it's a nice thing to witness this that people are finally waking up yes and and so this is some of the things i want to share with you my youtube has been uh, stopped for a week now because obviously i'm sharing some stuff that they don't want to hear so uh, I hope this, uh, this video reaches as many as possible amongst you, among my friends on Facebook and share it with all you can and, uh, and I confirm to you the best is coming. All that we see right now is just the end of, of, of the three-dimensional world. Nothing can take this away from us, okay? The, uh, the higher dimension, the higher dimension, we already have won this game. So now what we see is just dismantling of all the lower energies that are working in politics and all these things. And this is a process that is happening organically from within out and also with the people waking up. But if you want really to make the change happen really, really, really strongly is from within out. Okay? So... Uh, this is what comes for me right now as an insight, as a sharing. And thank you for joining me in this walk. And let's keep on walking together and let's keep on 
fortifying this field of energy from within out and uh, just share your thoughts under this video and, uh, and be the love and be the light and uh, be the peace in the abundance and prosperity I am that I am, I am that I am that I am and so it is and so be it Namaste